what's going on guys today i have an amazing announcement that genesis is back the genesis we all love and grew with has officially updated and this update is the latest and greatest all right so let me do a brief overview of the new genesis i'll pick out a few movies a few tv shows and then i'll show you how to install this new updated version all right over here we do have our movies our tv shows our channels my genesis latest movies latest episodes tools and finally the search if we go to movies we do have our genres years people certificates featured people watching most popular most voted box office oscar winners and etc i will go to in theaters i will pick one of these movies let's say kung fu panda 3 now we're going to pick our source. We are going to pick the G-Video HD version. And it plays within seconds. All right, now we can go back. We can pick any of these movies and they should work flawlessly. All right, now we can go back to our TV shows. In our TV shows, again, we do have the same categories. I'll choose year this time. I'll choose 2016. I'll choose Legends of Tomorrow. I'll pick the first season and the second episode since I haven't seen it yet. All right, and we will pick the 1080p version. As you can see, it's working flawlessly. Now we'll go back. And without any further ado, let me show you how to install the updated version of this great add-on. All right, so the first thing we are going to do is we're going to go to System, File Manager, Add Source. In the source, we're going to type in HTTP filmcodycom slash repository. We can keep it named repository. Next, we are going to Settings, Add-ons, Install from Zip, Repository, and repository.filmcody.com. Once the repository has been installed, we're going to go to install from repository and we're going to click the CodyFilmCody.com repository, video add-ons, and Specto Genesis fork. This process will take a while. The downloading will stay at 3% for a little while, so have no fear. It will download. You just got to give it some time. I'll be back once it's finished downloading. Once it's all done installing, we will click on it. We will click launch. And there you have it. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy this video, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to watch more videos on Cody. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments down below and I'll respond as quickly as possible. All right, guys, till next time.